Smallworks. We're a company that's been around for 16 years and we specialize in creating really beautiful small infill homes throughout the lower mainland of BC. Over the course of the last 16 years, we've built over 400 ADUs. And what we've learned in that period of time is this how important this type of housing is to really accommodate the challenge we are having across our cities with land use. It goes without saying the biggest problem we have right now is lack of housing stock. And we know over the next 10 years, there's a huge challenge to meet what the actual needs are in communities across Canada. We know that we don't have enough labor. We also know that these buildings are increasingly becoming more complicated to build. And there are, there are fundamental challenges that we just can't add people in the construction industry and just adding activity will not in itself solve the problem. Currently, when we look at productivity in the construction sector, we're down annually almost 5%. There's no other sector in which this is a problem. And what we're creating is an opportunity then for that productivity to really increase in a significant way. And we have the legislative intent that now allows us to have this opportunity to bring this type of effective and innovative and expeditious building together in one package. We're looking at being able to build a home 30% faster, but more importantly, have that home or that size of home now house five families. Like we actually get quite a volume of work out of a small team and this is where we're going to see the rise in productivity and we need that if we're going to address the housing demands that are required not only nationwide but province-wide. What we do here is we train our personnel from the ground up and have them on site with multiple skills so they're able to execute a number of activities that we don't have to subcontract out. That kind of team building, for lack of a better term, and that effective team of a small group of people moving from one project to another or working on a few simultaneously, that's how we're going to be able to execute the volume of housing that needs to be required industry-wide. And what we need to look at is what we like to coin mass customization. So when we use the term mass customization, really what we're referring to is twofold. We're looking at uh, recognition that every lot is different, every community is different, so we can't just take one unit and make a square box and put it everywhere. It just won't work. However, we also know we just can't start from scratch every time. What we're drawing from is something that you might see more from the automotive sector, where we're going to take components, things that are already being built by companies that we know that work, that are effective, and we're going to put them together on site. We're looking at bringing together three key elements which in themselves are both novel but meaningful. One of our most innovative elements is our bathroom pod. That bathroom pod is a completely finished bathroom with an adjacent mechanical room and a common wet wall for a kitchen. This takes all the work that brings in multiple trades and has it done in a factory and has it shipped to site and installed literally within hours. This is probably gonna be the most impactful thing we can offer to the community at large. but we're able to really bring that next level of design. So this is something that's really appropriate for a residential unit. And now that we have products that are available to us that are more suited to smaller buildings, we're able to make that mechanical and really effective use so that we can have this bathroom pod, which basically comprises almost all the infrastructure of a house brought to site, factory built at a high standard with tolerances that are really um, both fine in the sense of craftsmanship and fine in the sense of something you can actually work with really effectively on site and bring that together so that becomes a nucleus of these five, six unit homes and having five or six of these pods and then wrapping that with this high performance building envelope really is quite different. In addition to that, then we're going to take our high performance wall system. This is sourced from a a local supplier and who is well established and this is an element that has been used in other forms of construction that now we're going to bring into these smaller residential buildings. And we know that pre-manufactured walls are the way to go in these urban infill projects. The third element 
is actually something that we feel really strongly about. Concrete has historically really been the most detrimental construction material to the environment. One of the biggest carbon producers is not only concrete, but also the work around installing concrete. And if we take that out of the equation, the opportunities to drop our carbon impact so significantly. When we look at a typical infill house, the work to put in that concrete slab actually is greater than a 60 year operational burden of what it takes in regards to carbon impact to, to operate that home. You take that out of the equation, that alone has such a meaningful impact. We also recognize that the foundation system that we're proposing will have to have alternatives. Some settings it won't work, some it will. There are alternatives that we are developing that will go with this, but we know that this is as an entry level uh, to most sites, this will be very effective. And what's great about it is it requires not only such little use of concrete, it requires such little disturbance to the site. This is going to be immensely beneficial to the environment. It allows us to give a home which is free of concrete and has a higher performance around its building envelope. And I think that is the key to our success in this project, is that we have brought together the best systems that are already proven out. And we're putting them together in a different way, which is to say that we have um, a winning combination before we even start. We're more than happy to start to share these systems Canada-wide, whether it's a matter of producing kit homes or creating manuals about how to approach housing. And we know we can make a high quality product with a great environmental performance. And we can do so in a manner which is expeditious and remains at a quality level which surpasses industry standards.